Divide Gold White Finale. Ganito ang scenario ngayon, kay Tero to. Empty hand, 5 cards in his main deck, 1 life. Nasa red zone. Siyempre, nasa red zone na yun. Nasa red zone na yun. Now, si Hiko man naman, ganun din, halos. Pero, puno hand niya. Tero to has, only has bloom on the field. Si Hiko man naman, tatlo. Tatlong unit. Pero to found the way to um to erase all all of Higuma's units. Yung effect ng effect ng territory niya. Na kapag nandoon si kapag nasa field si Bloom. Right? So ginamit niya 'yon, tanggal lahat ng units. Now, as uh, the final three turns were rolling, eto na naman Higuma's backstory. Pero Nag-start na yung kanyang backstory nung, ayun, nung tinalo na siya ni Tero to. Nung, nung tatalunin na siya. Well, uh, we learned here that Ishinome is actually will. Okay? Siya pala ang will na sinasabi ni, ni Higuma. Si Ishinome. So, if, uh, sinabi na lang ni Ishinome, eventually you changed. Right? You, well, basically, he's, he's telling the audience that Uh, Higuma uh, started out as a good guy. Right? Also a built divide player. Then eventually, uh, uh, as the years went by, nakita niya talaga how, how, how much evil uh, Higuma has accumulated until he's become this corrupt son of a bitch we now know. Okay? So, Terrible found a way to, yeah, to beat Higuma. Kasi, Nawala na siya ng, ano eh, halos discouraged na siya, demoralized na si Terato at this time. Pero, subconsciously, pinaalala sa kanya ni Bloom mismo. Na, oy, wag ka muna sumuko, Brad. You still have five cards on deck. I am one of those cards. Malay natin. The path is still open for you. Go for it. So, yun nga. Ang nabunot pa niya Si Bloom mismo So Yun nga yung sinasabi ko guys He activates the ter His territory effect Again Yun Eventually Well Although no one hit attack That one life by Higuma Is a burst Pag gano'n niya mm, Burst nga So No choice Pa Direct attack na si Si Bloom Taro si Higuma While Yeah, Higuma, Higuma himself was contemplating on the loss. So, balik na si Ishinomi sa, sa, sa piling ng mga, yeah, the good guys. He opens the door now. Kasi, siya mismo ang will eh, si Ishinomi. He, he has that power. He now opens the portal to the real world na. Okay. Malika na guys. Uh, pasok na kayo before I can't hold this uh, this portal open any longer ang hindi sumama si Sakura because naalala kasi ni Tero na Sakura doesn't have a body anymore baka hindi kaya baka hindi niya makayanan yung uh, yung journey pabalik so yun nga nagpaalam na si Sakura sa kanilang lahat and uh, pinabalik ni Kika yung Ayora ni Sakura yung, yung card So, yun, pinabalik ni Tero, binalik ni Tero to kay Sakura. Bottom line, everyone is at peace. Even Higuma. Final scene. <clears throat> While Tero to was walking away from, uh, from, from Hiyori's absurdities, eh, syempre, bumalik na sa pagiging, pagiging estudyante niya si Hiyori. Despite showing uh, in the first 11 episodes how strong How strong a battler she is now. Bumalik niya, bumalik niya pagka estudyante niya. So, he now, he now finds it absolutely absurd. So, nagpahangin. Nagpahangin ng mokong. Nakita na may isang bag na mga cookies dito. So, nakalata niya na. Binuksan niya. So, nagtatakbo siya ngayon sa, sa pinaka-entrance ng templo. 
Eh, nabubad din siya nila, nila Kika at Hiyori. Eh, sinab, explain nila niya. Mo, Sakura might still be, Sakura may be here. Ayun. Well, well, this is happening. Ayun nga, si Sakura na ang pinakita. Holding a stop toy. Tinanong na lang sa kanya ni Ishinomi. Well, we're, I'm assuming that that stop toy is Ishinomi na. Yun ang present form niya. Eh, sinabi na, well, tinanong na lang ni Ishinomi. Where do you want to, where to? Ala, 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 taxi nga eh. Sabi ni, walang sagot naman ni Sakura. We can go anywhere I want. So, as long as it's fun. As long as what, as long as our destination is a fun one. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Beagle, mga ka lifestyle. We're gonna break that finale down right now. Critics of style. Base! From the start of the episode to the time Kerato beats Higuma, talagang tense ang pacing. Because, lalo na rin at nung, uh, nung nawawala na ng, kumbaga, nabanghihinaan na ng loob si, si Teruto. Uh, big time comeback yung ginawa ni, ni Tero Torito for the past two episodes and the first third of the finale is no different talagang wow talagang talagang siya talag, talagang he, he proved he proved to he proved to all of us in that scene that he is the real main protagonist of this anime do I have complaints guys? no? auto na okay sabihin natin no Continue nga ang backstory ni Higo Manito. Pero, you would feel na na mukhang nararamdaman na ni Higo Manito kanyang pagkatalo dito. That's why uh, his backstory is continuing here. Flow naman. First gear shift here was um, yung Reality check moment ni Tero to. Nung kinausap siya ni, nung kinausap siya ni Bloom. For me, that's a no-brainer of a gear shift. Because, well, you can say, Tero to is now hallucinating because of, um, he's that demoralized already. Uh, I would be an idiot if I don't call that a gear shift. Second gear shift was known. That scene where Um, uh, Namitsu affirmed his um affirmed his commitment of carrying on Higuma's legacy. Pero of course he's going to do it. He's going to do it the right way. No, the moment he, the moment he, uh, he cut he cut that long hair of his. I, I found that cool. For me, that's a gear shift. Why? Because. The research of Build Divide is now in good hands. Sigurado hindi gagawa na masama ito tulad ni Higuma, si Ishinome, as ah, si Ishinome, si Naomitsu. And he recruited, of course, the card professor for, uh, for, for, for this, for this mission of his. Halata eh. He recruited niya ito eh. Final gear shift was when Sakura and Ishinome were talking. Right? For me, that's a gear shift. Bakit? Kasi, we all thought that Sakura is already done uh, in the anime. Pero, eto siya. Kausap si Ishinome. Asking, kung bakit, kung bakit, buhay siya sa mundong ito. She has a physical body na. Uli. Uy, sinabi na lang ni Ishinome na, well, You and I are one of the same. We're friends. Yeah, everyone is at peace now, even Sakura. So these three gear shifts that I saw, you can say that these three gear shifts define the finale. Plot lies. Well, I couldn't say na malinis yung plot. But because of the backstory sequence, Talagang, talagang legit na backstory sequence siya, guys. Planchado ang plot, bigo, mga ka-lifestyle. Unlike the one in episode 11, this was really short. 
it was short enough for you as the viewer to understand that yeah the boss villain is about to lose <laughs> kasi yun yun ang feels ko nun eh when I was watching this back story uh, I thought hmm mukhang na nare-realize na ni Higuman na malapit na siyang malapit na siyang ibasura ni Teruto <laughs> malapit na siyang gawin basura ni Teruto so he he's now contemplating on what he has done so far on on how he met Ishino on how he met Will which eventually becomes Ishinome so it's a well hard lot but although ayun nga pero maganda yung ano eh timing ng tapos ng backstory sequence sa sa moment of defeat ni ni Higuma maganda yung maganda yung pagkakasabay nilang dalawa so it will instantly give you an inkling that, well, yeah, you're about to lose. All right, go talk all you want. <laughs> go talk all you want, Higuma. You're about to lose anyway. So, right now, I got no complaints about the, uh, about the, uh, about how, uh, how, how ironed out this plot is. All right? It's, it's pretty decent. So, pace, slow, and plot, they all came together for this finale, folks. So, Build the Fight Cold White finale. We can even we can even consider this as the Build the Fight anime series finale. Yeah, yes sir. Two thumbs up. Bakit? Well, based on the number one fact that, well, the the main protag is back with a vengeance. Ayun, tinalo niya ang siya mismo ang humamang sa boss villain, siya mismo pa ang tumalo. And he was about to lose hope already. Kasi, maghina palang tulong nito si Higuma. Talagang, for a good, uh, for a good three turns, siya ang lamang sa laban, si Higuma. You, know, he was, he, you can say that he was in control of the man. He was in control of the battle. Then, for Teruto to suddenly uh, get fired up like this, then, Oi, nagbunod ko si Bloom. O sige, pa! Call, Bloom! Activate territory! Wala! <laughs> tae! Si Higuma. <laughs> Nagbukong tae si Higuma rito. So... It was, a, it was a really good, really good finale. Okay. So, thank you, Lyman Films, for giving us Build Divide Cold White. Oh, overall, the Build Divide anime. And, wow! The prospects of having another Build Divide anime. Parang hindi na. Um, parang hindi na. Although, the card game, the card game is still ongoing. Right? Probably, I don't know what the decision of Bushiro about uh, about the status of the anime franchise. But, wag muna, right? If Live and Films have a say on it, I I would they should say na nope, not for now. Okay, not uh, not right away because viewers are still viewers are still um what's called this absorbing what just happened in the finale and of course what happened in uh in build divide season two so mag muna and talagang you could really feel that it is that it is the end of the build divide anime so the pro yeah the prospects of of having another another build divide anime Malabo. Malabo. Because it was a definite end. There was a definite end to the finale. But anyway, again, thank you, Lighting Films, for the Build Divide anime. So again, ay, so again, for the final time, probably, Build Divide, Cold White. No, no, no. Oh, Build Divide. Build Divide, series finale. Ngayon ko na nasabi. Two thumbs up. Final two thumbs up for the beautified anime. I'm a lifestyle legal.
I'm not going to be expecting a build divide anime after this. So, we go! Wait for my next upload regarding the uh, regarding the other finales in uh, in this roster. And for those of you who are still stuck with the CHD, natapos ang build divide anime hanggang ngayon ganyan pa rin kayo. Ano ba? Uy! Uy! What? I got my uh, I got my chocolate mousse here, so I'm gonna. Well, I'll just watch you chill while I eat this. Enjoy this review, and I'll see you in the next one.